Good morning, Keller Williams, and welcome back to the KW Command 66 Day Challenge 9.0, and today is day 52. So today we're continuing our training inside of agent sites, but we're actually going to go out of outside of command to show you something inside of your agent site that you can use the next time you host an open house and you want a simple and easy way to have guests of that open house sign in and the best part is their contact information would go directly into your KDB command database. So let's take a look at that. We are going to go, I'm going to go to our website quickly such that I can pull up my URL, right? You probably already have yours memorized, but just in case we're going to go to our agent site. And when we do, the first thing we want to do is look up the property that we're going to hold open. So I'm going to put in the address. This is actually the address of a listing of one of my coaching clients and good friends, Sheila. Let's find that. Katie, there she is, 6315. So I'm going to pull up the listing page, right? So you, can, uh, you can't see. It's just off the screen of my recording here. Here, I'll just pull this down. There we go. Our, uh, well, whatever. Okay. At the very top, this is probably not the best way to do this. Let me do it like this so you guys can see the URL. Sorry, I was cutting off that URL bar at the very top. All right, so now you can see the URL. So it's our website backslash property backslash the address backslash a whole bunch of numbers. We don't really have to worry about that too much. We just want to make sure that we have got that address. We're going to come to the very end of the URL and we're going to put backslash, which is the one underneath the question mark on your keyboard. So we're going to click on that and then we're going to just type in the words open house all together. So open house, no space, no dash, just open house. It's going to take maybe 10, 15 seconds, just depending on how long it takes to load. I don't know if that's your computer speed or the internet speed, but whichever. Just like that, we have now created an open house sign-in page specific to this listing. So let's say that I'm visiting Sheila at her open house and Sheila hands me her tablet, her Surface, her iPad, whatever it may be, she asks me to sign in as a visitor to the open house. And so I'm going to come in and I'm going to put in my information and only because I've already become a lead in this database from the home valuation tool yesterday, if you'll recall, we're going to put in my personal information, my legal name and my AOL address. Yes, I do still have an AOL address from when I was 16 years old. You're welcome, Brooke. All right, so I'm going to check a couple of boxes. First box I have to check is, hey, I agree to the terms of use. Second box I check says, hey, I'm giving the agent that's hosting this open house, so this would be your name here, permission to contact me at the telephone number and email address I provide. They have to check both of these boxes in order to submit the information. And when they click on submit the information, they immediately go to a property page where they have a QR code. So you can tell them, right, when they give you back their tablet, Surface, you know, laptop, whatever, hey, did you get a chance to scan the QR code? Feel free to scan it. You'll have all the information about the property right there on your phone. So if you have any questions while you're walking upstairs, walking outside, etc., you can just look up that information. And of course, I'm here to help with that as well. So when they scan this QR code, they literally just go back to the property page that we were just on but it's a great way for them to have that information on their phone easily accessible. The other cool thing is we just got a new lead inside of command. So if we go back, we're gonna put that back up here and we now have a notification. We're gonna click on that notification and it's gonna say we have another agent site notification. Remember, this is similar to the one we got yesterday. This one was the home valuation request. This one is the agent open house contact form has been received. I can click on view contact and here is the contact of the person that just visited my open house and you can see which property they came through so you can see it's a property inquiry open house the address I've captured the contacts name phone number and email address right so all that information is now available for me to utilize by the way if you'll remember when we were doing smart plans there is an open house smart plan I can't remember if we added that one to our library or not. Let's just see, open, there we go, so we did. So if you haven't already uh, added the open house smart plan, go back to my smart plan videos and watch that or just download this from the library. I could click on select 
and I could literally fire this smart plan while they were still in the house, right? So literally the first part of this smart plan asks them, hey, how was the open house? Right, so you can now see that they've been added to that smart plan. If I do a quick refresh, and now we're automatically following up with them. Now that phone number I put in wasn't a good phone number, so that's why it's erroring out just as a heads up. But a pretty cool, simple, and easy way, again, go to your agent site, find the actual property address in the search bar, right? So you're gonna click on that search bar, you're gonna type in the address, once you get that address, you're just gonna add to the end of the URL bar, all right? If you remember, this is what we did, just so you can see that URL bar. We're gonna hit backslash, which is the one below the question mark, open house, give it a second or two, and immediately you're gonna have that open house sign-in page where all of the contacts would immediately come in. I don't know if you're like me, I used to use the paper version and I couldn't read half of the things that were written. It was just written in chicken scratch. Is that an E or a C or whatever? So really quick and easy way to capture contact information from your open house guests that automatically feeds into KW Command and drop them on a smart plan while they're still upstairs. That's it for today, guys. It's short and sweet, but very powerful tool inside of your agent site the automated open house sign-in page. As always, I hope you're having a fantastic day and I'll look forward to speaking with you again real soon.